Hello YouTube. This little center punch I made. It's made out of, I'll take a picture just if it'll show up, it's pre-war. It's 1144 stress proof. Cold drawn carbon round. Okay. Now, I quenched it in water. It's, it's hard. After I was done, I did my, so. I mean, you're not going to file that now. And before I did that, I sharpened it on my diamond disc. That is about a 15 degree angle on each side. This is about two inches here. This would have been two inches. Four inches is all I can fit in my little nano lathe. But this is the end where I had it center drilled for the tailstock. So I had to grind all that away. Because that was a hollow hole in there. Not quite quarter inch it's over an eighth of an inch but that's the only way I could do it then I had to chuck it into the chuck which this will go in the spindle so it would go in about halfway and then I machined this then flipped it around then machined it again and then I put it in like this and then did a lot of file work no matter what I used I tried my high speed steel bits my carbon uh, carbide bits this stuff was really gummy it did not I tried probably four different lathe bits that I've made that I use on other steel. This stuff was really gummy and nasty. So, I need to study up on stuff like that, why it was so nasty. I think it's because just a little machine, it's just too hard on it. But this was half inch diameter to start with. Now it is 7 16 on the handle, and this is 5 16 approximate. And then this taper was done with a file. And I left that blue on there from heating it. I think that looks kind of neat. It's kind of hard. I'm using that reveal bulb. I'm experimenting with bulbs again of what films good here at the desk. So we'll give you some pictures so you can see what it looks like. Of course, we did chamfer, chamfer. Some countries they say chamfer, chamfer. I like using both. There you go. Just a simple little tool. And I've already tested it and it will put a hole, it is needle sharp, it will put a hole. I made one out of a handle out of a ratchet and it was just so junky it would not hold that edge. It would not hold that fine point when I want to make a very small mark. So, this will solve the problem. Okay, thanks again for watching.